First off, what we're going to do is you're going to get your paper. Get your paper. Make sure to spread your fingers out as much as you can. All right? Then take your, your marker, put it down. Start from here and go all the way around. Make sure you leave some space because we're going to end up cutting this out. Okay? Keep going. Keep going. Spread your fingers. Spread them like this. All right. And before you finish up, you want to make sure you give yourself a little bit of space. Make a wrist right there. Okay. Now what you want to do is you're going to put your hand back on it and you're going to use your digits. That's this, these little lines right here, right here, right here on your thumb. It's right there. You're going to put it, you're going to put it on here and you're going to mark my digits. So I'm going to put it right here and I'm going to mark right there, right there, right there, right there, right there. We have a question. Yes, girls? I couldn't see. Can you see now how, it, how he did it, how he made little lines like that? Yeah. We're going to start cutting our hand around. Make sure you're giving yourself enough space, right? Don't make it too small. Just go follow the black lines, all right? So we're just going to start cutting away. Remember these little, little lines that we made? Those are or so we can fold them and you know where you're going to be putting the straw. So you just fold them a little bit, do that for all the fingers. You fold them and then you stretch them back out so they're almost straight. They don't have to be perfectly straight, straight out, but just so you have an idea. All right, <laughs> so then the next step is you're going to get your straws. I have color straws, but it's fine. We, we can use whatever, whatever we have. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to get my hand, put my straw, see how big these, the first one is. You just measure that first one and you'll cut 10 of that same size. Okay. So mine is this big. So I am going to mark it right there and I'm going to cut it. 10, 10 pieces of straw that are that size. All right, now we're gonna start using our tape and our string, all right? So for, for the string, it's better if you have longer string than shorter string because you can always cut it down, but you can't, if you have a short string, you can't make it longer, right? So you're gonna wanna cut, um, let me use a pink string so that you can see better. All right. So you're going to want to cut about this much. Can, can everyone see that? All right. And that goes all the way from the tip of the finger to past the wrist to just a little bit more. All right. And that will make sure that's so that you can make sure that you don't, um, you, you have enough so that you can pull the, the finger. And you're going to want to cut five of those. So what I'm doing is I am getting the first one that I cut and then I get a second one, maybe a different string color, maybe the same string color. I measure it out. So now I know, can you see both of them? There's two of them here. I'm measuring them the same length all the way right there. It's perfect. And then I just cut it. And that's the fastest way to cut them all the same length. So what we're going to do now is we're going to get our hand, our tape, our uh, pieces of uh, straw. And what you're going to do is you're going to get one string, bring it all the way to the top. Let's start with our pinkies first. Get a little bit of tape, just a little bit. We don't need that much. Press it there, almost as if it were a nail. Just make a nail. All right, boom, and that is it. That is the first one. If you wanna go ahead and start doing the second one, you can do that too. 
This way we can have a foundation so that the, the straw is not roaming, falling all over the place so that you know you don't have to hold it all the time. It's right there, it's ready, and then you can start working on that. So I'm gonna let you all do that and then we're gonna get back uh, together to finish it off. Okay. Here are the strings, right? I'm gonna start off with the pinky string, this one, and I'm gonna get the little piece of straw, go in, and for those of you that, this is where we'll find out if the string is too long or too thick, but this will help you out so you don't have to like jam it in. You can just slide it on in. Straw is on the string, you put it in to that first line, just like we said, that first line, then you get some tape, you put it on there, make sure it's on, fold the tape over on both sides of the finger, boom, done. You go ahead and get your second one, slowly. Hold on. I see you girls, hold on one second, we'll answer your question in just a sec. Slowly. And then you, there's this, there's the straw, here's a string, put it all the way up back to that second line right there. And then tape it. And then you tape it. Yes. And then once you're done with the pinky, go ahead and move on to the, the, the ring finger. All right. We're just going to keep doing that ring finger, then long finger, then index finger, and then thumb. At this point, you should have something that looks like this. So these are stuck on there. See that? and you should have two for each hand or each finger. Now, with that same straw that you used, what, whatever is left, you're gonna cut off a piece that's two times the size, all right? So you get it, get the straw right next to that pinky one. See how big it is? Make one that's the twice as long. And you're gonna wanna cut five of those. So you cut that first one like that. You put it next to the straw, you cut it again. Now you have two, you cut it again. Now you have three and you'll use five of those. The five that you got, all right, you're gonna get it. You're gonna put it on the string, slide it down, and you're gonna to wanna to put it right there, right where this line is. So imagine, imagine these are the bottom line of your finger before you get to the palm of your hand. That, that's where you wanna put it, right there. You'll tape it down. Like that. So you should be here now. I use that, those, uh, the ones we just cut out. Look at that right there. And those are, should be right here. So I have this much straw left. This is going to go right here. Can you see that? If you have enough that it goes all the way down here, that works even better. I grabbed them like this. I press them down against the, the table. I, so they, they're all straight. I put a tape on there like that. Pick them up and then just put the tape around and that's it. Now it's stuck. And you'll do that again towards the bottom. All right. So I take them up here or right here and down here. All right. We're going to put it right here and tape it down. But first you want to make sure you put all the strings in there so that it ends up looking like this. I put the last ones down here. And like I said, you can just start pulling. 